What I don't understand, amongst other things, about creationists that argue that evolution should not be taught in schools um, on the grounds that there is no evidence for it. Um, I, I mean, I can completely understand if you honestly think, if you honestly believe, you've looked at the evidence, you obviously, be, and you honestly, sorry, believe that there is no evidence for evolution, then you have the right to try and get that out of the education system. The moment that I start to doubt your honesty, however, is when you then try and get creationism in the curriculum in a way to almost try and replace evolution. I mean, I believe totally that the only things that should be taught in school are things that are demonstrably true. Anything else does not deserve the right to be part of the curriculum. So when you say there's no evidence for evolution, therefore we should have it out, out of school, I agree with you. If, if there is no evidence for evolution, I agree with you that it shouldn't be taught in school. But why the hell would you want to take it out of the curriculum and then shove in its place, shove something else that is equally as fallacious is just beyond me. Um, either you're a raving lunatic and need to be locked up or you're being dishonest and you're being sneaky and you're trying to get a creation myth in the curriculum simply because you believe it and anything that goes against it is wrong. That's anybody who wants to get evolution out of the classroom and replace it with creationism doesn't care about evidence even though they may use the buzzword they may say oh evidence evidence they don't care you don't care if you're watching this whoever you are you don't care stop pretending you do